Hello boys and girls, welcome to another video. In my last video I've shown you how I'm putting on a bat suit that I recently just got. In this video I'll show you how I'm repairing a Batman mask. I remember when I told you that I got a cheap one that um, isn't really probably the best, that isn't made of urethane, and because of that um, it tears really easily, so I have a giant hole at the back that I will attempt to fix. I've tried one type of glue, it didn't work, so now I will follow a tutorial by Cosplay Chris. Good thing is that I already ordered a new cowl. This time I did not save any money. I've ordered a proper one uh, that cost me uh, an arm and a leg. So I'm not too worried about messing this thing up. I just wanna see if it's possible to fix it and how it will look like after fixing. I will be following the tutorial, but not really because, for example, um, Cosplay Chris was suggesting to get um, Sika Flex 229, if I'm not mistaken. What I got is whatever I was able to get in Singapore. Wait, why is why is my camera like this? Why is why is my camera like this? Please stop. Please stop doing that. My face. My face is here. My face is here. Just you were supposed to follow my face. Follow my face. See? Here. Here. Here's my face. Oh my god, guys, this will not. Ugh. Yeah, okay, what was I talking about? I was supposed to get Sika Flex 229. Um, I was only able to get Sika Flex 221, which, well, I read through the manuals, is supposed to be somewhat similar. The thing says that it's extremely harmful, so I will have to do it outside. The first thing that apparently you have to do is to clean it with some alcohol. I got some isopropyl alcohol. Um, it's a very, <laughs> it's a very precious ingredient during the Corona times, when you everyone wants a piece of disinfectant for themselves. Um, but this is supposed to degrease the edges and make sure that the sealant will stick to it and will keep everything together. So I guess you can't really skip that phase. So this is my laundry area. This is pretty much the only place in which I can do any sort of crafting that involves any sort of harmful things to human beings because I don't want to die. I have to just cramp myself in this small area to try to do anything. <sighs> That's it. It's a very short job in the end. I just need to wait till tomorrow and see if it actually holds. Okay, time for part two of fixing the Batman mask. It's been 24 hours and I have to say I'm quite surprised it actually looks good. It's, um, well, it's not seamless, but it holds. It really holds unlike any other glue that I've tried before. So potentially this is the permanent fix that will make the mask work again. Today I will still apply a piece of lycra. So I've taken my old balaclava that I've used for motorbike riding. Cut a piece out of it um, and I will uh, put it from the inside. Um, I will try to still put a little bit on the seam on the edge so that it would not tear open again whenever I try to put it on. All right, so I'm all prepared. Little space so you have to adapt and do what you have to, which is do it right next to your washing machine in the only outside space available. So um, I have my gloves ready. To the floor is protected, the mask is prepared. Well, let's do it! Alright, I'm halfway through, uh, but the uh, washing machine started spinning, so I had to pause it. Um, let me show you how it looks like from the inside when I'm halfway through. Um, I just got this piece of lacquer right inside to reinforce the seam. So you can see that the I put a, a thick layer of Cicaplex underneath, then I put the uh, piece of lycra on top, and then I'm putting Cicaplex again on top of the lycra to blend it in and to make sure that it really holds the seam together. All right, I'm done. Um, here, let's see how it looks like tomorrow. I. Honestly, thing it went well. Right now, it actually looks quite alright. Okay, the back isn't super clean. I will try to scrape it a little bit to make it look better. But it's it's better than I thought, and it holds, which is the most important part. I think I've saved it. I'll try to put it on, and let's hope that the seam will not um, tear again, and that it will all last. Okay, so here is the cowl, here is the seam, and here is me trying to put it on and seeing if it will last. 
putting a curl is never easy. Haha, -ha, I'm Batman. I think it's still holding. Yes, it is! Amazing! Oh my god, so Sika Flex works. Um, the tutorial by Cosplay Chris um, is correct. You can actually follow it to fix your bad calls. Okay, and now one more test. Um, I will try to take it off and <laughs> see if... I'll show you actually if the scene still holds. It does! It does hold, guys! It's all still together. Um, well, almost. There is a little bit, a little, little hole there, but it actually does hold. Um, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and click the bell button if you want to see more of my videos. Bye.